So hello guys. Um, as you can see, but since the last video, I kind of doubled my MMR with okay win rates, I guess. And the problem now is every game when I get like positive KDA like this one, um, or enemy goes like zero ten, or the other games that I go like twenty eight kills, twenty five kills. Or, or 38. Yeah, these are <clears throat> a little bit high uh, KDAs, I guess. But like the, I'm getting accused with smurfing, which I'm not, as you can see, like this anti mage game. Um, not, I'm not smurfing. Um, <clears throat> well, I was playing League of Legends. Um, it's also a mobile game. Um, and I was really, really good at it. So I implemented all of the skills I learned from that game to Dota, basically. And I'm going to show you how do I in-depth play the game um, and win the game, basically. And let's show you my battle report, too. Um, also, <clears throat> I played Winter Wyrn as support, and I have a really good win rate with it. I wanted to show you that. Um, Death Prophet mid is just broken. Basically, you b barely can lose games. Uh, Bloodseeker also 10 to 4, and Viper is 9 to 2. Just broken heroes, just ab abusing them gives you good win rate. But I'm gonna start playing Queen of Pain now on because I really like her, and I'm gonna show you how you sh what, what you should do in the mid lane basically. So now we're in the queue. Um, this is the bands I suggest you. Um, uh, unlike League, it's also on League too. Mobile games are basically how you counter the enemy, right? But the problem with these heroes, they're hard to counter. They're expensive to counter. So I ban them as much as I can. Um, <clears throat> you don't want them to go and play towards mid and like ruin your game that's what you basically what you want so what I do is okay we're getting a punch that's fine what I do is mainly just wait see the enemy and my team's comp there is a Twitch streamer I guess I don't know <clears throat> I show my hero to you. 10 seconds to go. <laughs> 5 seconds. I hope someone picks it. If not, I'll pick it. Your pick. Take your time. I can pick it, bro, I guess. <laughs> no, not yet. Might be not mid. I play her on mid. Uh, you can see people's win rates. Also, Dota Plus have been doing really great. 10 <clears> seconds <throat> to go. Five Four to eight. Seconds. My win rate cannot be that though. Your pick. No pressure. Always <clears throat> have a ward for mid lane because it's super necessary. There we go. <clears throat> I'm gonna show you why exactly. Um if you don't play with a ward, you're probably gonna lose your game, lose your lane. If enemy supports comes and clears the ward, and your support support doesn't come and clears it back, you're probably also gonna lose the lane. Like this, is how it actually works? Like um, in Dota or any MOBA game, the main power comes from vision, and you want vision. Vision everywhere. You want only fight with vision. You only want to look at your mini mini map. That's how you play. <clears throat> also, the builds. Um, there's guides or plus assistant or nothing. You don't need to use any of that. I just like it because um, I'm kind of new at the game and the items are a little confusing for me. But you should make your own decisions, in my opinion. <clears throat> Not like build every game the same stuff. Queen of pain. 
this one is so we're not gonna go with the shadow strike build that other people does because i really don't like it this barely deals any damage i don't open until like nine or something because it's quite useless but whilst the um, blink and scream of pain is really really strong and really <laughs> scales well you want to like <clears throat> be able to blink fast so how i put my ward is as further away as possible so I can just like see both ways most of the area oh we don't have a punch <clears throat> I think it banned it's alright as long as there is no punch you're safe to like stand over here but if there is punch I suggest you like chill over here somewhere <clears throat> also why I like this character is the uh, 30 seconds to battle look at this <laughs> and this what is this damn what the hell I think we can get the first one up here oh, yeah. nice first blood and it came so easily Make way for your queen. Who's mid? This guy is mid, I guess. <clears throat> so something new on Dota in me, for me, <laughs> is this minion blocking thing. It's just really cool. Like, oh my god, I missed it. Because I'm recording. It's alright. <clears throat> so buddy block is not really a thing in League. But in Dota, it's a big part of the game. Like, you can buddy block enemies. Body block minions. Yeah, I should focus on farming man. Oh. <clears throat> so I'm gonna poke him and I'm gonna hold my oh, uh, didn't work but it's alright. So what I really wanna do on lane I like the most is people don't poke each other too much, but I like poking the enemy. While he's hitting the minions, I'm gonna come up to him. Oh, uh, how to attack him? It was never yours. Radiance courier has been callously murdered. How to attack him and leave? Good. I poked him really well now. So he's, he wants to come and do this to me now. I poke him. Oh my god, he missed it. Oh, he panicked, dude. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm <clears throat> trying to play this hero as explosive as possible. Because people panic, actually panic when you like, play it fast. Dota is, in my opinion, is a really slow game. So, always I push my lane just before these runes spawn. So I can get them both and win the lane basically. So, before I take this one, I want to trade with them again. Nice. Now I'm gonna go and take that rune <coughs> and heal. Um, no mana. I'm lucky. Royalties. Steal my mana, sir. So. It's a free kill. You always watch the other lanes. This is truly a free kill. I'm just going for this, I guess. I have mana for a W and E, and that's enough. Let your yeah, teammate yeah. know. Well played. Stop. Good night. It's not time. Very well played. Well played. So, we dominated the other lanes. <clears throat> now they're gonna start winning the lane. And 
Uh, enemy team is tilted now because I came really early to their lane. I'm gonna do the same with the other lanes. What you wanna do is abuse the level advantage you have. Because level advantage on mobile games really OP. So how long for the... So a little bit. Yeah, I hit them. Keep poking him. <coughs> I use my bottle. Get a Into new one. Bottle. Nice. Next time we jump on him, he dies. So he has to leave. He doesn't know I have my bottle, I guess. So I'm gonna wait. I just hold him for my mana till the last second. <clears throat> so he doesn't think that I can just jump on him and kill him. So I push the lane. I'll make sure he loses the minions. Then I go and take this. That's all I want to do. <clears throat> Meanwhile, I get this. And an item. I don't know. Shoes are always first, but I don't finish the shoes. <clears throat> They're low, so I'm gonna go. If there is no vision. I think I can get one of them. I'm all, almost about to be level 6. Get another teleportation. I think this is vision, so I just sleep. Oh, I don't and I don't want to waste time. I don't want to get over leveled by this guy. And I don't want to dive these guys too. <coughs> I just play a little too aggressive right now because I'm ahead and he's, he's scared of me, so I abuse him. Well, I need another ward. The treasury grows. Check for the power runes. He might have get one. It's okay. If he comes from this way, that means he got one. Yeah, he got it. It's okay. Oh. I'm not gonna have enough mana I play dash for my ult. Take this room, and I'm not gonna hold. Nice, for no reason. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna dash the- oh! I bottle oh, it lets me. Into the bottle, your top tower is under siege. Nice. So I don't need to go to base. Thanks for that. So what I wanna we do here come. is hold him from out of vision. Make sure I have enough mana. Oh, I can do that while he's CC. That's okay. Oh, no, attack. <clears throat> oh, I didn't get a ward. What happened to my ward? Oh, I didn't call the period. That's alright. So I want to push this. So I can go to the power ruins in time. Let me check this one first. Yes. Bottle Royale. Missing bottom. Every time he 
is not showing up, I'm just gonna say is missing. <clears throat> Simple as that, but it's really important. So, since he lowered my mana pool, I just used the last. Into um, the back, I go here. How do you say? Nice. Dio structures Clock have been tar. fortified. <laughs> I will love it when you resist. So we're doing well. So far. It's just not so hard to do what I'm doing here. So like, this is not really surfing in my opinion. This is just playing the game well, reading the game well. <clears throat> Anybody can do this. Your middle tower is being I always attacked. keep one tower, town, portal, school, whatever. Ah, oh, the shadow TP. I'm distracted. But always push mid lane before anything. We have our W so we can just catch up fast. <clears throat> oh, haste. I want that. Haste. I got there. The haste rune is really strong. Agony awaits for the royal coffers. <clears throat> so, um, a big problem that I do you got it coming. that Your causes me issues is, is using my ult on other lanes and not being able to kill the laner that I play against. Because some laners you really need the, a little extra damage from the ult. But I think like dominating on one lane is just Your top tower is under attack. sometimes better. What I want to do here is just leave because they're two. They want to fight me. And this guy, okay, this guy's leaving. Your top tower is being attacked. This guy gonna like just banish me. So I'm just gonna deal a lot of damage to him. Next time I do that, he's gonna die and it doesn't have anything to do. Oh, nice. What? Why he died? What? <laughs> Wait. Dyer has fortified its structures. I don't understand. Why he died? Is that his passive or something? I have no idea why he died. Your top tower Shouldn't have been is under siege. There. Interesting. Your top tower is being attacked. It's Oh, no, nah, you didn't, bro. No, nah, you didn't. Dress warm. Agony awaits. It's okay. We, have to... we need more gold for it. Anyway. <clears throat> oh. 
Dyer's barrier has been callously. Can I have my dog on thingy? I'm gonna be able to one shot people and it's real strong. <laughs> How much left? 200 gold. So, after some point, all I need to do is like lower the meters, press E, last it, and leave. Okay, must be there. Yeah. Bottle Royale. So, I have an idea. I'm just gonna leave one here, and one go there. That. Your top tower is under attack. Can maybe. Uh huh. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Nah, I'm. I don't have molds yet. skill to the last second <laughs> so I know he's gonna jump so I just use my blink and yeah, this is how you dominate the game I guess just over now. my team's so ahead because thank I, you uh, Shaker I love you because I ganked them early way too many times there is no way. That's foolproof now, wish for Into the bottle. And sometimes, of course, you I might lose even though you like ganked and did everything. That's just literally rest is mechanic. Uh, how mechanically talented you are, you might be able to carry. Um, if you unlucky, if it doesn't work, it's whatever. You're gonna be still be able to like double or triple your depending on your Let's get this mid tower. Mi minion's gonna give me vision. Your I top tower is up. being attacked. If I c if you can see them, they can see you back. That's the idea. This is probably the most heroic thing anyone's ever done while sitting motionless. Could have been killed or am I think I like to use this as a like make sure last hit. Like depends of course, but I wanna use with you my skills to coming. have a higher DPS, otherwise they just can like panic and did don't wanna like scare them off. You don't wanna like let them know that they're gonna die. Like make don't make it obvious that you have enough damage to kill them. That's the important rule. <clears throat> you just like poke a little bit, poke a little bit, then boom, they dead, you know? Into the bottle. Yeah, I have no rush to kill. 
back, walk, do stuff, then blink up. Like, I don't need to like chase him down, auto attack him. You just gotta play a little bit Your top tower jumpy, is under siege. in and out, in and out. That's how we play it. In that case, they cannot really do anything. They cannot block me in any way to play in them. They cannot do anything about it. If there was a silencer and stuff, I would chase him down, like auto, auto attack him to death. But silencer cooldown cool and disarm me, so it just depends. Depends on the game situation, I guess. So now we have mana. We have our dragon, almost level max. Now I what what I want is this Daganim shard. It just helps you insta farm all the waves instead of the auto attack parts here. <clears throat> In silence is the enemies, so they just like literally become praise. They cannot do anything. So we have vision here, so that means I can hunt people from this area now. Which doctor is a breeze? I don't think I have to use my ult. Oh no, I'm dead. I'm dead. Uh, that's that's greedy, but it wouldn't be worth if I ulted him. Oh, maybe it will be. Strong at this PA. Yeah. I think it's more worth than this guy, but what I want is which doctor not gonna be able to carry this game. Is under attack. <clears throat> He's level 9, I'm 16. But like, instead of like PA, I, I prefer to hold PA or this guy. I don't know what he does. Maybe not. Okay then, which doctor and PA? Like, you should decide who to ult. Maybe Timber. Oh, I'm a little Timber. It's probably nothing to worry about. <clears throat> Planning ahead who to ult is just saves you from that Your situation that you die seen. like I did there. Your top tower has fallen. <laughs> Grief counseling will be available at the conclusion of the match. Yeah. Mistakes happen. That's all right. Bottle Royale. <laughs> So what I want here, I can go and fight with my team, but we we want all these pushed all the time, <clears throat> if it's possible. You want to pressure from every different lane at the same time. I love it when you resist. I just grab these, just like a tiny little health, but does good when it's. At this point, generally, if I was like feel like there is a way of they coming back or they like good players and stuff, I like tell my team to go tormentor because it gives me this a chance to give me that. So P8 apparently killing my team, so we're gonna go assassinate her till the end of the game. What happened? Just gonna go kill her. Go kill her. Just sometimes he doesn't have to walk somewhere. It's not time yet. Oh, we didn't get the last level of it. Let's do that. What? So someone, I thought. So now we have our shard too. So we or W also. That's really good. We should push for this mid tower and then go back to Roche. Nice. Take those. A few seconds later. Oh my god, that's 
that's really long. Okay. Do I have enough mana? Alright, we should wait for us. Or she's top in 45 seconds. Hold and die to that. His magic. Um, shield. <clears throat> this will come in handy. Bottle Royale. I think I'm just gonna go come back. Because no, it's not really No, worried. go Roche before we push high ground. Agony awaits. So what I want here, what's my next? I want to level up. And I finished this already, that's good. I think I'm gonna go and kill him. I'm gonna use my ult 2 or PA. Nah. So he has vision here, so I'm not gonna get close there. I'm gonna walk to the lane. I'm assuming there is no... Okay, put the vision there. I'm ulting first. <laughs> then, using my skills. Because ult is really weird to land. <clears throat> I should let him go for the rush. Okay. All I wanna do is now pushing lanes because I insta push lanes now. Look. The sun has been killed by the now. So what item? I think this is good. Your middle tower this is a good is item and saves your ass so many times. It's not time yet. Your middle tower is being attacked. <clears throat> it's not time. I'm still not one shutting, one shutting. Ah, oh, no, I should not. I should. I'll use my bottle first. The enemy's top tower has been destroyed. Into the bottle. Alright, let's go, everyone, top lane. Push this too. I should be able to Come launch on top, it. On top lane. We're pushing the lane. There we go. Until he explodes and attack his push. Top, we can siege top really easy. I've got a ward that lets us see the tower. Yeah, we should be pushing top. Uh, Shaker or Quap, we need one of you to initiate. Maybe. There we go, okay. Nice. My team's thinking, like, just, just push top, but if I don't pressure here, it's gonna be harder to push top. So, I feel like I'm just gonna keep pushing. And I can't come. Come clear it up. Your bottom tower is under attack. The enemy's top barracks have been destroyed. Gonna act like I'm leaving. Keep it up, I'm gonna hold this. 
Acting like you're leaving, it's just generally works. Gonna use the enemy's jump, I guess, to buy this. No. Doesn't work, whatever. I guess the carrier is on its way. I have mana. The enemy's middle tower has been destroyed. Ooh, ooh. This lane is not getting pushed. The enemy's middle barracks has fallen. As much as possible, we want all lanes pushed all the time. Pressure the enemy, so they have to decide. This is just crazy. Is that what she's gonna do? enemy's middle barracks has been destroyed. Your bottom tower is being attacked. how you basically play the game and win the game and be accused of smurfing all you have to do is play smart make uh, give a lead to teammates early on then you will just win really easily like this this is how i double my mmr to um, don't need to crush the enemy in the mid laner in any way you don't even need to kill them if you if you cannot <clears throat> Just check for the map, check for the push lanes, make sure you don't lose any XP. Um, and go and literally one-shot them because the level level difference is just too, too strong. We added another, another win to our history. We're doing fine. Um, I'm curious what's going to be my MMR, like <coughs> where, where is my actual level is. Gonna figure that out soon, I hope. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I don't know. If you like this video, just like it so I, I can do another one. Um, yeah, this is my hero stats if someone's interested to um, hear. <clears throat> so, PA. These are the strongest heroes in the game, in my opinion, to play. Uh, not terribly, though. I just had an arcana for it. I got it from a box. So as you can see the win rate here, if you go down, just one lost, two lost, three lost. Like you cannot barely lose. Bloodseeker, barely lost. Like and also you need to consider this. I played first time this heroes on ranked to learn. So I didn't go to a turbo game or a normal game. I just play on ranked. I just YOLO play it. And that's that's why the one loss or two loss or three loss coming from. Um, and also I was like Herald. Uh, and my team was so much worse than this. Uh, but it's all right, I guess. It doesn't matter anymore. We almost 1,700. Uh, when I posted my last video, I was 900. So I almost doubled my MMR, 
and <clears throat> before that video I was like 600 and stuff so I almost tripled my MMR with this technique basically um, also I, pl I, pl I like to play supports and with supports I have really good KDAs too supports are great too if you guys are interested I can do a support in depth gu guide to you and you might be playing better than I do that's also fine then you don't need to watch it you can just go and enjoy your 5k MMR games thanks for watching guys see you later